There was this young girl who asked me a question. She asked me, can you tell me about peace? What can you say when its opposition won't cease? It's a constant element in a world torn by differences. Rifts created by false witnesses claiming opinion as fact, with those caught in the middle only wanting silence back. Peace is one of those things that can exist when war is going on somewhere else. And the coming of war usually has one tell. My country is the greatest. Peace requires vigilance. Or so they say. If you want peace, seek justice. Or so they say. But for me, the price of peace is understanding and bravery. What I mean by understanding is that differences are all subjective. So try to understand that life and situations differ from one another. Be aware that different backgrounds create different people. But just because you don't know or understand why they do what they do, doesn't make it wrong. And that's when bravery needs to stay strong. Because fear tends to enhance one's fantasy. The imagination of fearful people breeds hate for what they don't know. And being unwilling to grow keeps you in that state. So one side has to choose to forgive the other. And that young girl is what you might want to learn. Time will change. Society will distort itself into something you barely recognize anymore. But human kindness will always be at its core. When faced with other cultures and ideas, try to use eyes of respect ears of love, and a heart filled with patience. Don't create your reality by media's views of the world, because then you will never broaden your horizon any further than what's around the corner of what you've always known. When you look around, pain, death, and destruction, not all that is found, your future is always success bound, as long as you believe it to be so. Young girl, the sky will bring you storms, sunshine, and rain. Life will deliver heartache, Sadness and pain. But all you need to do is be the own captain of your ship, Fino.